Do you guys want the best NBA 2K22 Dribble Move 6? Well, you guys came to the right video. This video, I'm going to be showing you guys the best things on NBA 2K22. But look, I'm going to need you guys to go grab some popcorn, grab a little snack or something, because y'all already know this video right here is going to be a banger. Yo, what is going on, YouTube, man? Welcome back to another video on the channel, man. Y'all, look, bro. Today, we got the best dribble scenes on NBA 2K22. You know what I'm saying? Today, I'm going to be showing y'all, and uh, I'm going to be showing y'all my sigs. The, literally the best dribble scenes on this game right now. And I'm going to give y'all some tips and some tricks, you know what I'm saying, on dribbling. And overall, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I'm going to give y'all the best dribble scenes on this game y'all already know y'all already know the drill bro like, i tell y'all this every video before we get into this video y'all make sure i leave a like drop a sub if you new and turn post notifications on you know what i'm saying but uh without too much talking let's get into this banger so these are my controller settings you make you guys make sure i need to put y'all vibration off the shot me off i mean that's this really personal preference your pro stick function but these three right here are important so your pro stick function make sure it's on default the pro stick orientation make sure that's on absolute make sure it is not on camera relative because that can mess up your uh dribbling you know what i'm saying so put it on absolute and off ball offense mode make sure that's on absolute if it's on camera relative change it to absolute asap you know what i'm saying so double team would put that auto put this auto player icons that don't matter skip pads that don't matter Pro stick type, put that on normal icon default. Receive control handoff pitch. Pro stick defense, put this on absolute so you do not slide on defense. Who to guard? Put that on uh, the pass target. This is for like your passing. So say if you're in the corner, right? Say if you're isolating, for example, you're isolating and you drive to the paint. This, if you put this on, like copy my settings right here, it's gonna dot the person that's open all right so you make sure you want to put the pass direction on one and the distance on one and put openness on 98 all right so yeah these are the controller sigs you guys want to copy all right i am going to show you guys the sigs right now so as you guys can see why we are in the dribble styles you know what i'm saying so the first dribble style you want to do these is actually i got actually two dribble styles you guys can use all right but I do reckon, highly recommend y'all to use shifty or quick, all right? So, it's between these two, you know what I'm saying? So, put on shifty or quick, but it really depends. Nah, nah, nah. I'm going to say I'm going to have to go with shifty, all right? So, for the dribble style, make sure you guys have one shifty, all right? So, we're going to move on to the next dribble. All right, for the signature size up, bro, you want to make sure you got on Derek Rose. I feel like this dribble move right here can create a lot of space and it can ultimately confuse your defender depending on your play style. So if you like the left, right, like me, this is definitely going to confuse your defender. So I do highly recommend y'all to put on signature size up for uh this dribble move because I'm telling you, bro, this dribble package, this dribble style is just overall great all right so we're gonna move on to the next dribble set okay signature combos by baron davis has to be one of the quickest signature combos that i've seen so far all right so you guys want to make sure you go with baron davis all right so baron Davis. you can either do baron davis or um isaiah thomas that kind of like 2k19 if y'all remember the 19 dribbling but <coughs> I'm gonna have to say Baron Davis. For the size up escape, y'all already know Trey Young might have one of the like it's so much stuff you can do. You can do the crossover 16. They got the little um that move right there. They got that move right there. Bruh. And that little behind the back. Like bruh, I'm telling y'all, the Trey Young size up escape has to be one of the best escapes on this game so far that I have seen. Cause y'all already know. In different seasons, new seasons are gonna come out. So Trey Young is definitely the best size up escape package right now in this game. But let's get into that next dribble 
Move. Moving crossover. I actually recommend y'all to use two, but it's really up to y'all, like I said. So you can either use Giannis moving crossover or you can use Stephen Curry, but I would recommend Giannis. Alright, depending on how you feeling, you can use Stephen Curry, but I'm gonna recommend Giannis. Alright, where we're gonna be on to the next. Now the behind the back, bro. If I do that Steezo, you know what I'm saying? That yeah, I know what I'm talking about. That Steezo, bro. I'm gonna go with Damian Lillard, bro. Damian Lillard is the uh, what was that one behind it? I forgot what behind the back it was on 21, but yes, bro. Y'all, this is because none of these like these other ones is not, they're not it, bro. I'm not gonna hold you. I don't know why you get added this, but yeah, Damian Lillard is the best one in my opinion. So y'all make sure y'all put Damian Lillard on. Moving spin, bro. Y'all make sure y'all put on the basic one. This. Basic one spin is a so moving spin, and the, you know what I'm saying, a little steezo, you know what I'm saying. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna recommend moving spin basic because that's the you know what I'm saying, best one out right now that I know of. And uh, yeah, now for the moving hesitation, I'm gonna go with Ray John Rondo, bruh. Ray John Rondo, like, bruh, just look at it. Just, just look at it, bro. These other ones don't compare to Ray John Rondo. Overall, I think this move right here creates a lot of space. And it's very different from the others. So, you guys make sure you put on Ray John Rondo. And for the moving step backs, this is actually... I got two. You know what I'm saying? If y'all play 2K17, this was Elite 2 from 2K17. So, I... You know what I'm saying? This this, this step back right here just bring back memory. So, I would say Jimmy, Jimmy Butler... Or you can do Kyrie Irving. The reason I don't like this is because I be stepping out of bounds with the hesitation. You know what I'm saying? The normal one for 2K17. And I don't know. I mean, some people still use it, but I recommend a Jimmy Butler. And uh, yeah, these are basically going to be the SIGs. You know what I'm saying? Um, <clears throat> this is uh, basically all the SIGs that I use. So yeah, if y'all made it this far to uh if i made it this far uh, to the end of this video uh i want you guys to comment your favorite nba player with handles you know what i'm saying me i'm gonna have to go with alan iverson but uh yeah this is gonna wrap up this video if i made it this far you know what i'm saying another thing i need to do is hit that like button you know what i'm saying because it's gonna help me out a lot it's gonna help the channel out a lot but uh yeah it's been your boy jerk and I'm out. Y'all boys, stay blessed.